Matt Petrillo joins us from Marconi Plaza and Matt, a South Philadelphia police captain has been reassigned but could get his post back. Is that right? That's right, and on top of the Philadelphia Police Union, there are a lot more people behind me standing out here in support of Philadelphia Police Captain Lou Campione. Now, take a look from Chopper 3 from above. You can see just how massive this group is that's been gathering for the last half hour in support of the captain. Now, in the middle of the plaza, all those people in blue, they're, of course, the Philadelphia Police. And on the other side of the fence is a small group of activists, not more than a handful, calling for further action on the captain. He's a 42 year veteran of the force, but the police union says he was reassigned from South Philly all the way to the Northeast after they say he diffused a situation from over the weekend. You might remember on Saturday and Sunday clashes between a group of people protecting the Christopher Columbus statue, some of those who were armed and a group of activists who wanted it removed. When you talk about neighborhood policing, that's Captain Lou. I don't know. What else to say? Uh, he started programs within the FOP that helps officers. He started bottles and badges. He started a, uh, uh, you know, when a police officer gets involved in the shooting and needs help afterwards, that's Captain Lou. I call Captain Lou often. When officers need help, we go to Captain Lou, bottom line. And on top of all these people out here in support of Captain Lou Campione, we're also told that many of them are also calling to fund the police, something that we've heard a lot of people wanting to defund over the last few weeks, many of them wanting to send that message as well to Philadelphia city leaders. Reporting live in South Philly, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.